Hi everyone, I'm Kate Wu. Welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to paint grapes. This is what I bought in the market. So let's get started. Get some ink. Don't get a lot of ink because we are not going to reuse them. Use a large brush, take a bit on the tip and start painting the large leaves. I usually paint two or three large leaves at a time, depending on how much ink there is on my brush. For the grapes, I'm going to use a bit of yellow to mix with blue to get the light green. If you want a wider spectrum of color in your shadings, you may add a bit of orange at the tip after you mix the green. That's what I did, and, um, and this is what it looks like. Just a very little bit of orange at the very tip. So as you paint, the water of your brush belly will drop down and dilute the color on your brush so that you'll get a lighter color as you paint. I am painting the grapes in small clusters, like three or four at a time, and makes new color when it runs out. I'm going to paint three big clusters of grapes dangling from the top and I'm going to start fast forwarding in this section so that you don't get bored. Grapes comes in many different colors, green, red, purple, and even black. Back in the old days, I've seen some ancient paintings that uses blue to paint grapes. In traditional Chinese painting, we don't use pink and purple that often until very recently that we started to use the tube forms which comes in all kinds of colors. I'm going to show you what it looks like when the Chinese watercolor mixed with the West. So if you are new to my channel and haven't subscribed yet, it would be great if you press the bell notification and subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out any updates. Now I'm going to add a green tone bird. The green is pretty much the same mix um, as the grapes, just a little bit of darker with more blue and then some orange color at the tip before you paint. I like the hat to be a bit darker. And then an orange beak. The chest is also colorful. I would use some yellow and orange tone. Now I'm using ink to add some stems for the grapes. Grapes are a type of woody vine, so I'm going to start connecting the composition by drawing some vines, the main vines for the birds to sit on. And then another one on top to connect the other grapes. And then I'm going to add a bit more details by drawing the smaller vines that goes around the main vines.
Feet and eyes always came a little later until the first paint was almost dried. And then I'm gonna finish it with the little dots at the bottom of each grapes. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. I'll see you next time.